Yo, what's up guys? I just want to give you a little bit of information on the COVID-19 virus. So, just a few tips and suggestions in these crazy times. Um, first and foremost, I would definitely, definitely freak out. I think that would be a good idea because, I mean, when was the last time you really had a good excuse to freak out? You might not get another one. So, with that in mind, I would really cause some, you know, some disruptive panic. I would, you know, knock at your neighbor's door, you know, looking frantic and asking them, you know, for toilet paper and demanding that they give you some of their food. Okay, guys, this is how you get free toilet paper. Give her your toilet paper. Oh my gosh, you don't have to do this anymore. Thank you. <laughs> you could, you know, slap your boyfriend in the face. Hey, what was that for? I don't know, the coronavirus. And uh, tell him what a piece of trash he is. And, you know, I mean, with this excuse, you can really do anything you want and probably get away with it. Uh, I personally have been taking advantage of this situation and uh, myself, I've been stealing from Got a lot of corporations and just walking into Whole Foods and just helping myself, looting stuff. Police probably aren't as active as they usually are, so the chances are you'll get away with it. Don't wash your hands and don't be clean. If, you, if you're really smelly and you stink, nobody's really going to approach you. Drink lots of vodka. Everyone knows that alcohol uh, kills things like bacteria and viruses and germs. The vodka that you drink and consume will kill the virus. I'm drunk right now. I, I, I had uh, about two gallons of vodka for breakfast with my Cheerios. made a bowl of Cheerios and put the vodka right on there, made it a little bit easier to consume. You might want to get the virus as quickly as possible. I feel like now is a great time to get it. I mean, you, you don't want to be that guy who, who's late, right? Gets there last, you know, way, way, way after like everybody else has done it. You know, it's cool right now. People care right now. If you say you've got it now, you're gonna get a lot more emotional support. People might send you things, you might, you might get stuff for free. People are a bit more sympathetic. But if you get it now, right now, you know, a lot more people are gonna care. And I, I told people I got the virus a couple of weeks ago, even though I don't think, it, I think it was just a normal flu. Everybody was just running around, doing whatever I wanted. I, I stayed in my bed the whole time, playing video games, and people brought me food. And you know, it was, it was pretty cool. So even if you don't have the virus, um, you should at least say you have it. So yeah, there are my tips on coronavirus and I hope they are helpful for you. Till next time, peace. Okay, so I hope you know that was all a joke. And I mean no disrespect in these difficult times. Be safe out there. I'll probably do the opposite of all the advice I just gave you.